What's going on guys? Cameron here with the Lawn Care Life in Missouri and I think the winter weather is finally here. So uh, it's been, for the most part, pretty dry here in Missouri. Been out, able to get out and get some leaf cleanup done, get some uh, cleanups done in general. It's been super nice weather. Been in the 50s, 60s, we even hit like 65 during Christmas Day. I mean, it's crazy, unusual temps, but uh, hey, we'll take it. But today, it's cold, it's wet, it's nasty, and let's check outside and uh, see what it looks like. I'm hunkered down here in the shop, trying to get a little work done on a Saturday. But check this out real quick. It's rainy, it's nasty. We got puddles over here in the drive. The leaves, nice, soggy, and wet. Got the rain coming down. Cleaning out the uh, dump trailer over here, getting it washed out. But yeah, I think the uh, winter weather is finally here in Missouri. We've been fortunate enough to be able to get out there, get a lot of cleanups done, but uh, the rain's moving in. Cold weather, nasty. Don't know when it's gonna dry up. So with that being said, we're probably gonna be spending a whole lot of time here in the shop trying to create this into an office, hoping we can uh, transform this place. And within a month from now, hoping that it'll look totally different in here. So uh, stay tuned. This week coming up, you'll probably see a lot of footage shot here in the uh, shop and kind of uh, showing you guys what we got planned and, and uh, how the progress is coming along. But anyways, guys, this is the winter weather that everybody talks about. This is what slows the business down in the wintertime, and this is what keeps uh, revenue and profit from rolling in. So uh, in our lawn care business, we do a lot of cleanups this time of year trying to do more actually this year. Now we will be able to uh, get out there, maybe clean up some brush and things like that, throw it in the dump trailer, haul it off, but we're not gonna be able to do any leaf cleanup for a while until those leaves dry out, the ground dries out, all of that. Maybe you're in the landscaping or hardscaping business. I know a lot of guys have reached out here recently saying they've had some snow or maybe some had, had a lot of rain and just kind of put the uh, business at a standstill right now. Hey, I wanna encourage you guys, the weather, we don't know what it's going to do, right? We don't know what's going to happen from day to day even. So uh, whatever weather God gives you, uh, try to use it to your advantage. If it's wet and nasty outside, good time to get indoors. Maybe you, maybe you uh, get into your office, maybe get into your shop, work on some equipment, maintain that equipment. Maybe it's getting into the office and working on estimates or working on uh, materials, marketing materials, or just getting an idea of how to grow and how to run the business uh, in 2020. So, you know, it may be nasty weather. We may not be making a whole lot of money this time of year, but at the same time, we have the opportunity to take advantage of this weather and work in the shop, work in the office, get all those things done that need to be done in order to grow the business, in order to run the business efficiently. So that's what we're gonna be dealing with. That's what we're gonna be working on. Uh, like I said, this week coming up, you'll probably see a lot of footage here in the office, just kind of showing you guys the plans, showing you guys the progress. But I wanna encourage you guys, if you got some bad weather, man, don't get depressed. Don't worry about it. Just use it as an opportunity to grow the business. Use it as an opportunity to think about how you can build the business. Uh, use it as an opportunity to uh, think of ways you can add more revenue or, and think of ways to add more value to your customers in the off season. So what I'm going to be doing a lot of is working on social media marketing for my customers here locally in our area. I'm going to be getting my face out there, getting my name out there. That way in the off season, you know, we may not be showing up every week to take care of their property, but they may be seeing us online each and every week sharing tips, sharing some value, uh, just sharing about what we're doing right now in the off season. So uh, that's super important to stay in front of your customers, even in the off season. That way, when you transition into the busy months where you're out there uh, working on their property, hey, everything will just kind of roll into the season nice and smooth. So that's what we'll be doing. I know it's nasty out here. Hope you got better weather than this, but if not, Guys, take advantage of it. Anyways, guys, I just wanted to share this quick clip of what I'm up to this weekend. It's Saturday. i uh, going to sp spend time with family today. So just out here for a couple hours trying to move things around and straighten things up. And then I'm going to head back into the house and, uh, and uh, hang out with family. But anyways, it's nice to have the shop here at the house so I'm able to do that before. 
Uh, we didn't have a shop at her old house. We didn't have a garage at her old house. We didn't have a shed at her old house. So anytime I needed to work on equipment or work on ideas for the business, we always had to go to uh, our family shop. We got a huge, I think it's a 50 by 60 maybe shop down on, on our farm uh, where our family lives. But you know, I was able to go down there, maintain equipment, work on it, things like that. But now I'm able to actually do that here. So it's super nice. I can jump out here for a couple hours, work in the shop, and then head back into the house and hang out with family. So uh, that's what it's all about, right? Trying to focus more. And this year on 2020, uh, focusing more on the family and trying to uh, streamline the business a whole lot more. So uh, we'll run more efficiently in the spring, summer, and fall. And that way we can take off earlier, hopefully have the weekends off, and hopefully um, have that good balance with the uh, family, work, and everything else. So uh, anyways, guys, I'm Cameron with The Lawn Care Life in Missouri. Thanks for stopping by. We'll catch you guys tomorrow on The Lawn Care Life in Missouri channel. So I uh, hope you guys have a blessed day today. Hope you're enjoying time with friends, family, or uh, just taking it easy. But anyways, guys, as always, God provides.